The Heart of the World by Nick Kahn. Where Long Champs had been, there was now a Plymouth shop selling chain store women's clothing. Politicians did not drink now, not where they could be seen. So the city hall place these days was Ellen's Coffee Shop, run by Ellen Sturm. She had once been a Miss Subway system, but the outside windows were plastered with glossies of other Miss Subways. Inside was diet soda and lots of fatless fiber. So that was the difference, right there. At Long Champs, your dinner was six large whiskeys, and here it was skimmed milk. Fun was the word he kept returning to. There had been so much of it around, and today there seemed none at all. Sometimes you read the papers, you watch TV, you talk to the people, Matty said, and all you keep hearing over and over is, what in the hell happened here? Lots of stuff was the short answer. Watergate for one, tapped phones for another. TV, because on the screen, the people could see your smile freeze while your face melted when you were caught in a barefaced lie. You couldn't get some aid to cover your ass the way you could with the press. And then, of course, there was 1975. What happened here? New York went bankrupt, that's what. The change had already started creeping in before the default, but the longer Matty looked back, he had to say, a whole lot of world ended right there. Tammany Hall and the clubhouse and the rest of the machine... They had all stood on one basic given, that the city thrived, always would thrive, and however much of the pie you cut up, there would be plenty left.